and Japanda Man. Welcome to IJM's second summer special. Today we travel to Sydney for Smash. Now we were lucky enough to get an interview with the World Cosplay Summit organizer as well as super duper special guest, Rika. But first of all, let's check out what went down. Hey everyone, it's Japanda Man. And Neko. And we're here today at Smash 2014. There is so much to see and do. It's anime, anime, anime. Everywhere. Let's check it out. <laughs> What is your name or cosplay name and who are you cosplaying? Uh, my cosplay name is Sakana and someone uh, my nickname is Fish. My character is called Saika Magoichi. She is um, basically a gunslinger from the game Sengoku Basara. Alright, who are you cosplaying today? I'm cosplaying Kojuro from also Sengoku Basara. Uh, my main person that I'm supposed to be paired with is not here, unfortunately. Aww. So I have no one to pair with. You guys, you can pair, it's all good. Yeah. <laughs> Quite sad, but... Uh, <laughs> Who are we cosplayers today? Uh, I might pronounce the name wrong, but Tsuhime from same thing. Yep, Sengoku Basawa. Um, she's like archery chick, but she's pretty naive and uh, like ditzy kind of girl. So she kind of ends up in situations where I'm just like, what are you doing? But yeah, she's like adorable in her own way. <laughs> she sounds gorgeous. <laughs> I'm cosplaying Yamanaka Shikanosuke from, he's a new character from the last game. So unfortunately, which it hasn't been translated into English, so I only know the gist of his character, but I just um, really connected with him because he's exactly me. at Smash was the World Cosplay Summit with the winner travelling all the way to Nagoya, Japan to represent Australia. You could feel the excitement in the air. We were so pumped. We had to have a sit down with Kenny, the WCS organiser who brought the competition to Australia. Hey guys, so it's Japan Demand and Neko here and we're joined by Kenny who happens to be the World Cosplay Summit organiser. Kenny, thank you so much for your time today. Uh, thank you. Thank you for... So interviewing me. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. <laughs> so Kenny, what exactly does the World Cosplay Summit coordinator do? Uh, so I have to organize the, the events here in Australia. Uh, so I've got to get a set of judges uh, ready to look at all the teams that are entering and prepare the, the stage performances. Um, and after that, it's actually, my job doesn't actually finish. When we've selected a team to go to Japan, I have to actually monitor them throughout. So they have one whole year to prepare new costumes, new performances, wow. and uh, there's a lot of, uh, of little bits and pieces that needs to be done. After that, I go with them to Japan. Lucky. And <laughs> yes, very lucky. Very lucky. Uh, and I get to help them there. So, because um, they have lots of meetings, like that's, they get to meet like the mayor of Nagoya, wow. the, what? the the Ministry of uh, Foreign Affairs uh, in Japan, 
Um, and there's like all these parades and so many things happening. So I'm there. Red to carpet. Yes. Wow. Yeah. So it's quite involved. It's not just yeah. a matter of, you know, do this at the con and then go home and relax. It's 12 days in Japan. 12 days. And there's so much to do. And, and also like... Uh, there's a few days off where I just go with them to, uh, shopping. Yes. Uh, shopping, yes. Yeah, I, I took them to Bunny Cafe this year. Oh, awesome. Yeah. They really enjoyed it. Yeah. Wow. Awesome. Sounds very involving, but it also sounds like a, like, the, you know, like the dream job at the same time. It, it is pretty fun. <laughs> <to> <laughs> Definitely. Now, how does the, I guess, how does the WCS differ from other cosplay competitions? Well, it's a, a whole higher level um, of, of quality uh, in terms of the costumes mm -hmm. and also in the performances. It's very uh, intense, the judging, isn't it? It is yeah. very intense. And um, there's a few other uh, competitions like that around the world, but WCS is the top one. Mm. Yeah. That's, yeah, it's not hard to see why. Yes. <laughs> yeah. So how would you say Australia rates in the worldwide scale of cosplay? Well, we, tend, we seem to be always like c coming toward the, the top five. So we ranked... Um, so we don't suck. No, we don't suck. <laughs> we came second twice. One wow. year we got, we got Best Costume Award one year. And we don't have the results for this year yet, but I'm assuming we're also fourth or fifth again. Yep. It seems we're eternal fourth. Yeah. Always. Well, I know we didn't get top three, but I'm sure we But I can tell you, we came second of costumes. Oh, wow. So the costume itself, we were second. Well, I did see the costumes and they were very impressive. Were impressive. So. You'll get to see that tomorrow um, because uh, Francis and Luke will be in, in those costumes tomorrow when they're judging. Awesome, we're definitely going to have to check that out. Um, so what exactly is involved in the judging and what sort of criteria do they need to meet? So 50% um, of the mark is for uh, the costume. So we'll be looking at the quality of, of the sewing and or, or, or putting it, the, the armor piece together. Mm. Uh, there's accuracy. So we, uh, we'll look Which at is the, very important. Yeah, you important. want it to look like, yeah. Okay. So we look at the original uh, artwork and uh, basically we'll be comparing it to make sure it's as, as close as possible. Mm -hmm. And the last bit is basically the technique. Techniques that we used. Um, uh, if they use some fancy technique, uh, and it, it's really New well technique. done. Yes. Uh, we reward uh, the effort that they put into it. And then the other 50% is the performance. So are uh, uh, um, interesting the, the performances, are uh, well uh, uh, rehearsed, they, ha they have been... No mistakes. Yes, yeah. yes. <laughs> Make sure that like, no pieces of costume fall off on the stage. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's happened to me before. Not a good thing. Not good, yeah. Co cosplay problems, yeah. Yeah, I yeah. know, right? <laughs> and also, what about WCS is if you go to a regular cosplay competition, usually the cosplayers come on stage, they do a performance. Mm -hmm. Like a but skit? They, they mm. don't have any uh, uh, stage props. Oh, yeah. yeah. But WCS is always uh, stage props. And it basically makes you basically uh, go into this world. And yeah. it's, it's just you feel like you're in the actual anime or yeah. the Yes. So it's about painting a very, I guess, a very um, accurate picture. So it's like you're looking at a scene from the anime. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Awesome. yeah I guess probably one of the more, like, the more important questions is: this sounds like the, like the dream job to have. How can someone get involved in, like, you know, behind the scenes of, you know, the WCS Summit? Yes, I'd like your oh. job, please. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I'm, not, I'm not ready to give it. Ooh. Ooh. Not yet. Uh, not yet. Not ready to step down. I'll give you my card and you call me. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> at the moment, because uh, WCS actually moved events. We used to be at Animania. Mm. And, uh, and now we're Smash. But I'm actually the only person really running it, okay. uh, officially. Good job. But we have a few people that have been supporting over the years. So one of the judges tomorrow is Widya. He's been supporting from the start. And uh, he's always been behind, always helping, coming to Japan to, to help. So really, actually, all you have to do is contact me and say, I want to like, come to Japan and uh, be there as a supporter. And you can be part of the, of the support team that uh, and you get to actually go on the parades in costumes. You get to experience a lot, awesome. of things, a lot of the things that the cosplay, the actual team actually gets to experience. You can do it just by coming along and, uh, and, and supporting it. So expect an influx of resumes once this goes oh, to air. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Australia always gets the biggest group. Like the entourage? Yes, we have the biggest entourage. It used to be the Koreans, but uh, we took over that uh, about two or three years ago. Go with Australia. Gotta keep representing. Gotta Come keep, on. Yeah, bring it. <laughs> bring the power. <laughs> Um, I guess, yeah, Kenny, look, thank you so much for your time today. Obviously, really it's, appreciate it's it. very, very busy here today, as we can see. And it's just been great to meet you. So, yeah, thank you very much for your time. And we all appreciate it. Thank you very much. We'll definitely be at the judging tomorrow, yeah. too. So. And follow us on Facebook. It's WCS Australia. It is. Yep. We'll do that.